For early voting for the November 16th runoff set a record high for the number of ballots cast for a non-presidential election. Well, that could foreshadow a high voter turnout on Saturday. And Paul Murphy reports on what the numbers could mean for the Louisiana governor's race. It's now a sprint to the finish for Republican Eddie Rispone and Democratic incumbent Governor John Bell Edwards in the runoff race for Louisiana's highest office. Looking at early voting, which ended on Saturday, there was a surge in black voting. African Americans accounted for 31 percent of the nearly 490,000 votes cast. If that continues, that will help the governor, but it won't necessarily put him over the top. Edwards needs to win 90 percent of the black vote and at least 33 percent of the white vote to be reelected. White Democrats, white independents, and other race Democrats and independents, um, that is where the decision is going to be made about who the next governor will be. Based on early voting, demographer Greg Rigamer expects as many as 1.7 million Louisiana voters to cast ballots in the runoff. The interest is across the board, demographically and geographically. So who does a high voter turnout benefit, Edwards or Rispone? Political analyst Clancy Dubo says it all depends on whose supporters show up to the polls on election day. We'll be looking at voter turnout, uh, not just black and white, but urban, rural, and suburban. We'll be looking to see what kind of percentage John Bell Edwards gets, say, in St. Tammany and Jefferson, and also what he does in the congressional district represented by Ralph Abraham. Edwards led during the primary by a wide margin, but combined, the GOP candidates, Rispone and Abraham, received more votes than Edwards. Is that majority sticking, or is some of that vote for Abraham moving over to John Bell? One thing that's clear from all of these numbers, at this point, it's anybody's race. Paul Murphy, Eyewitness News. And we want to disclose that pollster Greg Rigamer is working as a consultant to the Edwards campaign. Also, a programming note, tomorrow Governor Edwards will be a guest on the Eyewitness Morning News at 6 a.m. Eddie Rispone was scheduled to appear on Thursday morning. Election day is Saturday. The polls open at 7 in the morning, and we're going to have your first election results as soon as the polls close at 8. Plus, live reports from the candidates' election night headquarters. Stay with us until we've called all the major races, including those for St. Tammany Sheriff and Parish President. We're turning now.